This definitely isn't something that you see every day. A CSX train derailing off of the tracks. It's been about six hours since that happened, all happening around 11 o'clock. And as you can see behind me, that train is still there, but now not blocking Kenmore Avenue anymore. Again, this happening just after 11 o'clock when that engine derailed, causing parts of the train to leave the tracks and block traffic on Kenmore Avenue. A CSX spokesperson tells 7 Eyewitness News that the snow and ice was to blame for that derailment. Good news is, though, that all of the containers were empty and no one got hurt. There was no spills, nobody was injured. Uh, it's just a, the end of the train is sticking into Kemore Avenue by about 10 feet. Now, there were slight traffic delays all day today throughout the afternoon as crews brought in a crane to remove that train from the road. Back out here live, another big problem that workers ran into was all the snow. When they brought in that crane, they had to use a back service road, but that service road obviously had not been plowed, so they had to wait until they brought a heavy-duty snow plower to plow that back road so they could get that crane in here. And behind me, uh, that train was blocking Kim. Moore Avenue, but as we've waited for this live shot at 5 o'clock, it is now off of the road, but no word yet on when it will be off of the tracks or back on the tracks and moving again. For now, we're live in the town of Tonawanda, Kendra Eaglin, 7 Eyewitness News.